right, guys, so one of the things that you, we see uh, being done wrong a lot that we have to correct when people come here to Newell Strength is how to set your hips when you're doing a dumbbell row. So I'm gonna break that down in today's video for you and, and kind of break down the concepts so you can understand in your head. So if you have any questions, you post them below. Don't forget to hit the like button if you like this. And if you have questions on anything exercise or nutrition related, post them and we'll make a video about it for you. So the first mistake that we see when people are doing dumbbell row is they put a leg up on the bench. Okay? So we're seeing this a lot, right? This is how people have been trained. Not that it's terribly wrong, but when you're doing that, you're essentially taking the hips out of the movement, okay? We always want to try to involve the hips in the movement. That's your powerhouse, that's your stabilization. So that's one of the mistakes we see. Another mistake, I'm gonna show you the foot positioning that we see that is incorrect. So again, think of the base of a pyramid, you wanna be nice and strong. The mistake would be this. So on here, my feet are very, let me get on this side so you can see. Very close together, okay? My back is rounded, that's weak. We don't want that, we do not want that, all right? So what you wanna do when you're doing this is get the base of the pyramid wide, back flat. Okay, so the way I would do that is I'm gonna take, if I'm rowing my right hand, I would take my right toe to my left heel. Okay, so I'm gonna demonstrate this. Right toe to my left heel, that's my depth. I'm rowing on my right side. Step out wider than shoulder width, back flat. My hips should be loaded up here. So it looks like this. Got weight in my right hand, toe to heel, okay. Step out wider than shoulder width. Soft bend in both knees. Let me turn this this way so you can see. So here, the wider and shoulder width, flat back. You don't want to see this. Flat back, my hips are set back. Throw it up, and back down. I shouldn't have an excessive amount of weight on here. It should just be touching. This is the balance point. Up and down. Base of the pyramid, the foundation is where your strength comes from. Through, make sure your hips are always set. That is the base of your foundation. So that's how you set up for a proper dumbbell row. We're gonna go over in future videos how to set your hips, because if you can set your hips, you can pretty much do any exercise within the gym, and that's something we teach here at Newell Strength. Don't forget to hit the like button, peace.